Marvel Studios moving quick on She-Hulk and they found their actress. Let's talk about it. Hey guys, thanks for tuning in to Comic Book Nostalgia. I'm CB Nostalgia and we got a major casting update from Marvel Studios. But first, I wanted to remind everybody, if you're looking for your place for all your comic book news, rumors, and reviews, all while looking for the best and positive in those characters you love, make sure you hit that like button and press subscribe. Well, Marvel Studios is hitting us with the one-two punch. Yesterday, we found out that She-Hulk, at least the pilot, will be directed by Kat Corio. And today, we found out who is going to be our Jennifer Walters. Now, there have been some rumors that a major announcement was coming our way regarding She-Hulk, and earlier today, Deadline finally broke the news on who has been cast in lead role. Now, according to Deadline, orphan black actress Tatiana Maslany has been cast to play Jennifer Walters and her lean green gamma machine alter ego, the She-Hulk. Like we said, this comes right on the heels that Dead to Me director Kat Corio will helm it, and several episodes will be written by Rick and Morty scribe Jennifer Gao. Now, if you're unfamiliar with her in the comics, Jennifer Walters is an attorney who gains powers very similar to her cousin Bruce Banner via a blood transfusion. Now, we haven't got confirmation that Mark Ruffalo is actually going to appear in the show, but it seems pretty likely to me. Now, we've talked about a few times on this channel how we are a pretty big fan of the She-Hulk. She was actually Stan Lee's last character created over at Marvel way back in 1980. Now, that was the Savage She-Hulk line. In this TV series, it's actually going to be based on the sensational She-Hulk line, which came late in the 1980s and ran into the early 1990s. This series actually saw a much more comedic take on the character and was well known for breaking the fourth wall, very similar to Deadpool. I do expect we'll see a lot of that from this character. This brings up the question of whether Tatiana fits that role well, and now I need to go check her out on Orphan Black again to see how that clicked for me. Can she do comedy? I have no idea. Now, the She-Hulk is scheduled to begin production in Atlanta early next year, so obviously we're going to get a lot more details about the show as they come in. I do expect to see lots more Gamma characters from the show, and I do think the series will be the kickoff point for several Gamma-infused heroes and villains. Obviously, once we get more details about the series, we'll bring them your way immediately. But I'm really curious, since I'm fairly unfamiliar with this actress. What do you think of this casting for the She-Hulk? And do you think this actress can carry this character all the way onto the big screen? I think that's the big question. Sound off in the comments below. If you like this video, make sure you press like, click subscribe, and if you don't ring that bell, you won't get any updates. Peace.